Holly Senior Living, an alternative to nursing home care that provides support for daily living. Online at hollyseniorliving.com. Concord Equipment of Holly, making mowing and snow blowing fun and easy with zero turn radius hustler equipment. Wright Funeral Home and Cremation Service of Holly, Lake Park, and Moorhead, committed to exceeding your expectations since 1881. Muscatel Burns Ford, your Holly Ford dealer for new and pre owned vehicles, on the web at muscatelburnsford.com. First National Bank of Holly and Dilworth, your locally owned full service bank, both conveniently located right on Highway 10. Greater Holly Homes is ready to show homes no matter where they are located or who has them listed. Now is a great time to buy. Give a call or visit our unique website at greaterhollyhomes.com. The Shooting Star Casino, Hotel, and Event Center is a proud sponsor of the Holly Area Community Show. Visit us online at starcasino.com. Welcome to the Holly Area Community Show. I'm your host, Verna, brought to you by the Shooting Star Casino, Hotel, and Entertainment. Today we are at Holly High School with our activities director, Brett Schmidt. Welcome, Brett. Thank you. Thanks for joining us. Brett is going to discuss some of the issues going on with his activities director position, including the corporate partner program created with the Holly School Board. So, Brett, if you wouldn't mind describing some of these activities going on for us. Well, the Holly Community Schools has, uh, over the past three years, developed a corporate partner program where we have businesses, both local and outside of the local, um, immediate local area, um, who pay a certain fee every year um, to our high school, and with that, they get signage both at our football field complex, uh, at our gymnasium, in our fine arts area, and they get a nice plaque to display okay. in their business. These would be the big banners, the maroon and gold banners that yep. are hanging? The, okay. The, the, the maroon, gym. Yep, the gym we have maroon and gold banners. Okay. Um, when we get out to the football field they can actually use their own colors. Okay. All right, so logos and all that and then the funds go to what? Particular and, activities. Okay. At the, uh, every fall we get together with our, activ or our corporate partner committee which consists of a boy sport rep, a girl sport rep, um, a fine arts rep, uh, 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 one of the corporate partner reps, um, a school board rep, and two administrators, our superintendent Phil Jensen and myself. And we take a look at the amount of money that we have and then based on submissions, which are like a grant submission by the different programs, um, we decide what we're going to do with the money that's available that year. Okay. And what have some of the purchases been that we would otherwise go without? Yeah. That, and the purchases that we get are, are typically things we normally wouldn't purchase because mm -hmm. they're larger ticket items. Uh, for instance, one of the first big purchases was a batting cage system um, complete with floor protection and things for our gymnasium for both our softball uh -huh. and our baseball program. And then also some special curtains that our golf team can use that is a little finer mesh that they can hit golf balls into. Okay. Neat. Mm -hmm. All right. Sounds um, like a big job yeah. that you've undertook and a lot of help. Yeah, and it's students. been really good. And you know, the students get involved a little bit. Uh, they've helped us promote the program both to the businesses and, and just by what they do on and off the playing fields and in the um, okay. fine arts area. Good. Could you explain to us to um, the school board recently, some of the school board members recently attended the state? school board conference down mm -hmm. in the cities. Could you explain what they worked on there? Yeah, the State School Board Conference Association asked them to do a PowerPoint or a presentation on our corporate partner program. We've had a lot of schools ask questions about the banners in our gyms and okay. things like that and what we're doing with it. And so when they went down to the State School Board Convention a week ago, they actually uh, presented how we started the program, what we do with the funds, um, and how, how successful the program has been. Okay, yes, and it was a big hit. I had a friend attending from the Ballotin School District, okay. and she let me know that she sat in on it and was very interested in it. It was a, a huge informative session for everyone there, so good. very that was, good. That was kind of what the purpose was. We've had a lot of questions, and we just wanted to make, you know, let people know what we were doing. Yeah, all right, and we would like to share with the audience some of those clips from the presentation. Do you want to explain what they'll see? Well, um, the presentation had some clips that showed um, the sign, the signage up at our athletic complex, which is a football and track area. Um, it involves a football play, one of our student athletes running for a touchdown, and then the, the scoreboard area coming into play. It shows a scene from our gymnasium during the basketball contest and how we honor our corporate partners at every event. Um, their names are read and they're thanked at each and every event we hold at the high school. Uh, there's also some students that talk about some of the specific things we bought 
and there is also a, um, a clip from one of our local business people. Okay, good. Well, thanks for sharing that with us, Brett. Are there any, um, any ways for community members to get involved or if they have questions on this uh, corporate partner program to contact you? Yes, absolutely. They can contact myself, Brett Schmidt, here at the high school, or they can contact our superintendent, Phil Jensen, and okay. we'll be happy to get the information out okay, to them. Okay, and any school board member as well should be yes, able to help. Absolutely. So, all right, so we hope you enjoy these clips. Thanks for joining us at the Holly Area Community Show. First National Bank of Holly and Dilworth is your locally owned full service bank. Enjoy free first reward checking, a high interest bearing checking account with great rates. Both offices are conveniently located on Highway 10 or Bank Online. First National Bank of Holly and Dilworth. Muscatel Burns Ford of Holly offers a complete line of new and pre-owned vehicles from heavy-duty Ford trucks to economical passenger cars. The Parts and Service Department at Muscatel Burns Ford is your one-stop shop that keeps you going. Muscatel Burns Ford, your hometown dealership, committed to serving customers to their satisfaction right on Highway 10 in Holly. Hi, my name is Chris Kenny, and I'd just like to say the Corporate Fund has really helped us out by benefiting us with helping us buy portable stands for our touring band and uh, helping us buy microphones for our auditorium. Hi, I'm Jordan Iverson from Holly High School. I'm a senior athlete, and I'd like to thank our corporate partners for purchasing the batting cage for us, which helped us utilize our time and get more reps in batting. My name is Nate Matson, and I'm from Holly High School and I'm here to support the Corporate Partners program. Through the Corporate Partners we have obtained a game ready system. It has helped me and other athletes return to the field as soon as possible. It's a great program which has provided funds that all, athlete, all athletics have been able to use. For me, I've most utilized the game ready. Hi, this is John Newman with First National Bank in Holly, Minnesota. Uh, just saying a few words about our corporate sponsorship with the Holly School District. Um, I think it's a, a great partnership. Uh, we get hit up for uh, a lot of donations and uh, from various organizations and in, in this way we can make one contribution and uh, um, people in the community see uh, that we're a corporate sponsorship and uh, some of the items that have been purchased to help the school district um, go towards the fine arts program and the athletic department so there's a nice balance there. Um, they've done wireless microphones and uh, portable music stands for fine arts and they've uh, purchased some equipment for the athletic training department as well and uh, just feel it's a nice fit and gives us a, uh, some good positive PR at the same time.